Hey guys, it's Maddie and welcome back to my channel. So today it's going to be kind of an exciting vlog, vlog video. It's not really a vlog, but um, I'm going to be doing a Green Hawk haul and Green Hawk, Green Hawk is a horse store. And then this afternoon I am going to go ride for the first time outside in a long time. I am super excited, but I am going to be showing next summer. So I haven't showed in like four or five years now. My closet, my wardrobe needs a little bit of an upgrading. So Greenhawk had their customer appreciation sale. So I got all of this there and I am in love with it all. So let's get right into it. The first thing isn't very exciting, but it's just like a necessity. I needed to get this leather halter fixed. Um, the last horse I used it on stepped on some part of it. So snapped this back nose piece and broke a couple of the clasps and I wanted to upgrade the metal plate engraving. It said my old horse's name, but now it just says Armstrong, which is my last name. This is the halter, not too exciting, but just really good to have a nice quality halter on hand, leather halter. Next is this visor. I am so excited to wear this. This is like, a staple in a horse show person's closet. It's so cute. This obviously is not how you wear it, but I love the little ribbon bow at the back too. It's just so cute and I'm so excited to wear this and it's it got a huge brim. Next is another staple and that is a pair of um, black show gloves. These are the, are these Connect? Is that the brand? Is that how you pronounce it? Um, I don't know what style. Oh, the dynamic glove in black and medium. All of this stuff was either 15% off or on clearance with an additional 50% off. So I got a really good deal for everything here. And then I got some white show breeches. These are the Elation, are these the pre Elation Platinum breeches? They're just white with silicone knee patches. I don't know if you can really see that. And then a gray sock bottom. These were 130 on sale for 90. And they're just really good to have because the horse that I'm gonna be showing does jumpers and I've never done the jumpers. So you need white breeches for that to look the part. I needed a new show shirt and this is a t-shirt one. Not my favorite, but I thought it would be nice to have an alternative on hand because the show series that my barn does is the Silver Series. If you're from Ontario, you might have heard of it. They show at Palgrave and Caledon Equestrian Park, I think. Palgrave? Yeah. Yeah, Palgrave and Caledon, I'm pretty sure. Um, but anyways, those are four-day shows. You start on Thursday and you show till Sunday. You don't necessarily show every day, but... It's nice to have lots of duplicates on hand. So this is just a t-shirt. It is also the Elation Platinum with like blue and gray ribbon trimming and then a button and just that normal white button collar. And this was $60 on sale for 41. This, this next item, I. It's my second most exciting item out of this haul. And that is a new show jacket, another Elation Platinum. And this is in the color Wine Tasting. It's one of the mesh ones. Um, so it'll be super lightweight in the summer. It has a couple pockets, then a zipper front, as well as the button closures. This was the last one they had in my size and I Love it. I think it's going to look so classy. The horse I ride is a Palomino. So this is, will really pop against him. It was 160 and was on sale for 112 And the final thing I bought is hands down the most exciting. And that is a new helmet. It's a GPA little lady. And to say I'm obsessed is an understatement. I used to have a Sam Shield as my last show helmet and I actually ended up selling it because I wasn't using it and it was a really nice helmet to just be sitting around. 
Hindsight probably should have kept it, but I didn't and too late to go back now. So this is the GPA Little Lady. It also has that wider brim and I think that's really flattering on my head shape. And it's a really sleek look. I'm just obsessed with it. Like it's just so freaking cute. And this was on sale too. I don't remember. Original price was, I wanna say the original price was like five, 30 give or take and I think I paid no more than like 200 so really good steal for this and I just needed a new helmet I needed an upgrade and perfect timing so this is my new show helmet um I'm so excited I'm gonna wear this for the first time today when I go out to the barn to ride because I haven't rode in it yet and I want to use it I'm thought about being like, oh, I'll keep this as a show helmet, but it's like, no, I bought it to use it, so I might as well use it. Yeah, and get it like nice and like um, broken in for next year too. Like make sure there's no points that are like squishing on my head and uncomfortable that I can wear it for a long time. So yeah, anyways, I will chat with you guys when we get to the barn, I think, which I, I'm gonna leave here like pretty shortly. I think I'm actually gonna ride this morning before it gets too hot out because it's supposed to be really warm this week here. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys in a bit. Baza, hey mister, come on, let's go. I really hope you can hear me, but this is Chloe. I am riding her for a friend today. Um, cannot, don't know if you can see that, but that, that is Chloe. I actually used to own her Oh man, over two years ago now, two and a bit years ago, but I sold her um, when I went to school, but the bone barn owner bought her and then there's another girl who's part boarding her out of the barn. So she's gone and asked if I could ride her. So that was a lot of fun. She was good. She was a little spicy. She doesn't like when your leg is on, but all in all, it was really good to be back on her, riding her again the saddle so uncomfortable my ass hurts and my legs hurt now but i'm gonna head out here shortly from the barn I'm gonna go on tack hose her down a little bit same shirt same horse <laughs> different day today is tuesday i just finished baz riding baz we were walking out and i need to put the horses back out today the barn owner julie she asked if i would wouldn't mind putting them back outside and of course I will, but um, yeah, it was a really good ride. It was kind of quick today, a little off, but I think that's partially because every, all of the other horses are in the barn right now, and we're the only ones out here. And he is like Buddy Sour. He travels with his buddy Paco, he's a paint. But um, yeah, it was a good ride. It's really hot, so kind of only did a little bit, only about 25, 30 minutes of riding today. Too bad, but I'm tired now. 